how does your website get seen, right? So your domain is actually part of that. So this is um, what they call is a domain authority. And uh, Moe's came up with this. I think of it like a credit score for your website, right? Like, does everybody have a credit score? Yeah, we don't like it, right? But And some of us had to take a really long time to get it into a certain place. Oh, thank God. But the reason I bring it up is because most people can understand a credit score. So your domain authority is like a credit score. So what you want to do is put your domain into this website right here. It's um, mos.com slash domain hyphen analysis. And you can see how well you're doing. So we'll show you your domain authority. So the higher the number, obviously I used Forbes, um, the better you are. Um, and you can also see how many links in, if you have a spam score. It's really helpful because part of, remember, part of being found naturally or organically is having, you have to be credible. So people will link into your votes to you, but if you have a high spam score, that's a concern because then you may have a harder time getting that cleaned up. Um, how you would have gotten a high spam score is your website may have gotten hacked at some point and um, bad things happened on that domain. Um, someone sent out a lot of emails on that domain that were marked as spam. Um, it's rare for us to see a high spam score. Forbes isn't surprising to see a 1%, but if you see something higher than that, I would be concerned.